Hello, and welcome to, Today in History, I'm your host, Abdalman El Dara, and I'm excited to take you on a journey through some of the most significant historical events that occurred on this day in history, so let's jump right in. On April 5, 1614, Pocahontas married Englishman John Rolfe in Jamestown, Virginia. Their marriage helped to establish peace between the Powhatan Indians and the English colonists. On April 5, 1792, George Washington cast the first veto in American history. The bill in question was the Apportionment Act of 1792, which would have established the number of seats in the House of Representatives. Washington believed the bill was unconstitutional, and his veto helped to establish the power of the executive branch to check the legislative branch. On April 5, 1955, Winston Churchill resigned as Prime Minister of the United Kingdom. Churchill had served as Prime Minister since 1940 and had led the country through World War II. His resignation marked the end of an era in British politics. On April 5, 1818, the Battle of Maipu took place in Chile, marking a decisive victory for Chile's independence movement. Led by José de San Martín and Bernardo O'Higgins, the Chilean patriots defeated the Spanish forces, resulting in the deaths of 2,000 Spaniards and 1,000 Chilean patriots. The battle was a significant moment in the struggle for Chilean independence and contributed to the eventual liberation of Chile from Spanish colonial rule. On April 5, 1992, the siege of Sarajevo began during the Bosnian War. The siege lasted for almost four years and resulted in the deaths of over 10,000 people. The siege was one of the most brutal and devastating events of the war, and it marked a turning point in the conflict. On April 5, 1987, the Fox Broadcasting Company made its primetime TV debut with its first primetime shows. The network's initial lineup included Married, With Children, The Tracy Ullman Show, and 21 Jump Street which would go on to become popular and influential programs. On April 5, 1969, anti-Vietnam War demonstrations took place across the United States. The protests were organized by a coalition of anti-war groups and drew hundreds of thousands of people in cities like New York, San Francisco, and Chicago. The demonstrations were a key moment in the anti-war movement and helped to shift public opinion against the conflict. On April 5, 2009, North Korea launched a long-range rocket, which it claimed was part of a peaceful space program. However, many countries, including the United States and South Korea, viewed the launch as a cover for developing missile technology. The launch was widely condemned by the international community and led to increased tensions on the Korean peninsula. On April 5, 2010, an explosion at the Upper Big Branch Mine in West Virginia killed 29 coal miners. The disaster was one of the deadliest mining accidents in U.S. history and brought attention to the dangerous working conditions faced by miners in the country. The tragedy also sparked debates about mine safety regulations and the use of coal as a source of energy. That's it for today's episode of Today in History. I hope you enjoyed learning about these significant events that took place on this day throughout history. Join me again tomorrow for another exciting episode. Thanks for watching.